we learn how to create Google Sheet with Spring Boot and Java. Now in this video, we will uh, insert some records in the Google Sheet. We have already created the endpoint for uh, Google Sheets here in the last video. This is the endpoint we have created and uh, we have these two requests the first one is sheet name and the second one is data to be updated right right so in the previous video we only use this uh, param and we have we created a google sheet with this name in this video we also use this param i will insert will insert some records in the, into the sheet right so for that we have to do some changes in the code itself uh, here we have uh, uh, write the logic for uh, creating google sheet so here we have to add few lines to update the records into the google sheet right so for that right. so for that we have to use service dot spreadsheets dot update sheets dot values dot update here we have to pass three param the first param is to let's see the update method first A spreadsheet id range and the content and the content type is in value range we have to follow this way only this way uh, this method will accept so here we have already a spreadsheet object right we have already a spreadsheet object we can get the get spreadsheet id and the range should be uh, i'm just uh, uh, keeping the range as a1 okay the first row first column and here the null is range actually so before uh, going ahead let's first create a value range value range is equal to new value range dot values so in the from the request itself we can get the values get data to be updated and here it should be right is the error here set values change written type of get data to be updated okay fine so we have created this written type as a string we, have, we should make it as object right so here it should be updated right now error is has gone we have to add here value range right Return. return we should change the return type as well here get sorry get this red here so we do not have return type a spreadsheet url we, we will return a spreadsheet id Okay, so even we can uh, change the return type. Uh, we should uh, uh, use uh, some response DTO here. That would be better. So I'm creating one response DTO here. Google Sheet Response DTO. Let's create class in the DTO package itself. DTO package finish right so here we I'm adding few fields string spread sheet ID private string spread sheet URL and what else we can mm, Spreadsheet ID and HDRL. Okay, let's use 
these two values on the transistors. So here, uh, from the spreadsheet itself, let's change this as well. Full sheet response detail. Import is required. Right, so here we have to create one Google Sheet response DT object. Google Sheet response Let's make it as a response. Right. So in the response, I'll set spreadsheet ID. Get and uh, in the response, we will see the URL as well. Spreadsheet. Spreadsheet. Get. Right. So once this step will execute, I'm removing this spreadsheet ID from the So we'll return response only. Okay, so stop. Right. <clears throat> okay. So let's verify the changes. Here we have the sheet name. Beginner one two. I'm adding one more. Data to be updated. Updated. So it should be list of list of object here I should be I system design. Okay, so this is the list of list. fine. So here we are uh, passing list of list. Why? Because if you see the value range here, it will always set the values as list of list of object. Here it is list of list of object. That is why we are passing list of list of object. Let's test the API ones. Let's run this. Right, send it. We are getting some exceptions. Let's see. Required parameter spreadsheet ID must be specified. So, root cause required parameter must be specified. Okay. Null pointed exceptions. Okay. Start update. Okay, so I'm just adding. This will not impact anything, but I know what was the what is the mistake here. This should be updated here and then uh, dot Mm 
we need to add one more method over here this should be raw and dot execute we should execute this method right. <clears throat> Still, we are getting exceptions. Must be specified. Okay. Okay, we actually missed one part here. And that is uh, okay. Service dot spreadsheet dot first it should be create then execute and the return type should be a spreadsheet. Response okay with the help of this created response get okay that is correct and uh, this should be right right let's run this application again Now we got the response here, spreadsheet ID and spreadsheet URL. Let's check the URL once. But we, the data is not coming here. Is the issue? Okay. Okay, what is the data to be updated? Seems the key is mismatch. Here the O is in caps letter, we have to make it in small. Okay, right. right. Let's try again. Here we got the response. Let's see. Oh, right. Now we are able to. So we are able to uh, insert the records into the Google Sheets. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.